Hey there, I'm Irritating Shotgun, and this is some more Let's Play Fallout 3. And I can't remember what, what we were doing. I think we were knocking on these doors. Open the door. Hello? Is this the mailman? Oh, I do hope my fall catalogue has arrived. Sure, yeah, I have your fall catalogue. Oh, goody. I can hardly wait to browse the latest fashions. Please do come inside. Let me unlock the door for you. Yeah, that woman's a bit insane. Uh, and my eye is itching something terrible. Uh. What the hell are you doing in here? Get the fuck out. Jeez, calm down. Yo, what? No, uh. Calm down, pal, before I put a hole in your chest. Look, pal. There is no way you're going to get to me or my wife, so just back on out of here. What the hell is your problem? Do you understand English? I said, get out. Look, I want to be left alone. Can't you tell? Evan King told me to check on you. Is everything okay? We're great. Just peachy. I love sitting in my house with my thumb up my ass. Tell Mr. King that sitting here all day isn't going to make us any safer. We need to take action. Yeah, we'll just go now. Yeah, he's a prick. <laughs> Seriously, he just seems to hate everyone and everything unreservedly and without reason. Bastard. Just a moment, I'm just checking my um, stats again for when I level up. Ah. Yeah, we'll definitely need level of explosives if we want to get anywhere in this game. <laughs> Knock on the door. Yes. Who is it? Evan King sent me. Can I come in? Oh, he did? Well, it's about damn time he did something. Come on in. I'll unlock the door. I'm just glad to load the loading times on this uh, from Oblivion. It's nice to see a friendly new face around here. It's been a long time. The name's Karen Shenzi. Evan King told me to check on you. Is everything okay? Scared out of my mind. I'm glad he's checking on us, but until someone nips the problem in the bud, we may as well stay inside forever. Okay, we've checked that. One last house, and yes, there are two houses, but one of them belongs to Evan King, and there's no point checking that house, is there really? See, that's Evan King's. We need to get into this. What looks like it should be the toilet shed, but it's not. People live in here. I think. Oh my god, they're dead! They're dead! Yay. Damn. <laughs> These guys got fucked up. I lack the skill to properly determine the case of, well, let's just check with... Actually, that do I? I'm off by one, that's amazing. <laughs> the bodies of the West have bite marks on the neck area that go to the bone. And I've become addicted to Mentat. I have become addicted to learning. <laughs> so much learning! <laughs> sorry, sorry. Okay, so let's recap. One's a prick, one's scared, the other two are dead. Great. Oh yeah, and one's insane, but we didn't spend too much time talking to that woman. We'll talk to her before... Nah, I'm not going to give the game away. And now the sound cut out. Did you know the Wests are dead? The family must have gotten to them in the last attack. Sons of bitches. Damn it! If only we had more men, we could stand up to them. I'm sick of them terrorizing this town. Wait a minute. When you searched the West's place, did you find their son Ian's body? No, I only found the parents' bodies. This has to be the work of the family. I've caught that weirdo leader of theirs talking to Ian down by the river. Look, I know I've asked a lot of you already, but you have to find that kid. He deserves better than all this. Don't. Oh, well. The Wests had bite marks on their necks. Mean anything to you? Bite marks on their necks? That's the strangest thing I've ever heard. 
The family must have attack dogs with them or something. Oh, this is all I needed right now. What am I going to do? They'll keep coming back until all of us are dead. Don't worry, Evan. I'll figure out what happened to the Wests. Thanks, kid. You're all right. Don't be saying that later. Where do you think I can find the family? I think they live somewhere east or northeast of here. Problem is, they always travel in the dark, so I can't see exactly where they go. There's all kinds of places they could be hiding, like Hamilton's Hideaway, the old Moonbeam Cinema, or Northwest Seneca Metro Station. I have to go now. Next time I see the family, there's going to be hell to pay. And so, let's see. Okay, he told us there are three places that could be hiding. Hamilton's Hideaway. I know for a fact they're not there. Moonbeam Outdoor Cinema. I know for a fact they're not there. They're here. Let's place a marker. Actually, where's the water? I want to see if I can jump out. Off. To be more accurate. Can I... Either way, I'm jumping off now. Whoop. Well, that works. Yep, once again, it's time for a trek through the wasteland. I, actually, I'm going to take it. Uh, wait, actually, yeah, we were already on a mission from that Moira to get irradiated, so I might as well drink some water. Om nom nom nom. Come on, drink it, you moron. I think we were on a mission for I, I, I can't remember. I'd recorded that last set twice because, well, I'd fucked it up in the first one. Uh, might have skipped it. Actually, I'm going to check now. No, we weren't. But, yeah. We'll get that mission eventually. Ho hopefully, probably. How much radiation does this give? Not much. What kind of radioactive sludge do you think you are if you don't even give me much radiation? Actually, what is with these random patches of radioactive sludge? A bit odd. I mean, I know it's a nuclear wasteland, but... Just, like, two random patches? I think that's where I'm supposed to be going. Hop over the rubble. Hop over the rubble. Jump. No, I'm not going to start stealing that turn from Halloween. Doesn't even accurately describe describe how our character jumps. It's more of a blur. Um, uh, up here? No, motherfucker! How the hell do we get up here? Blur. That's that's the sound that should go with our character jumping. Blur. Blur. Uh. <laughs> How old is this guy? I think he's like 19. 19, Asian, got a black beard and kills people. What a nice young man. I've discovered several locations I can now fast travel. No shit. Said, reskin of Oblivion with better gameplay. And a better storyline. Oblivion, better with guns. And in a better setting. Yeah. Yeah. Shit, you can't see anything. There we go. <laughs> so, because the brightness is turned so high up on my screen, uh, so it'll record properly, uh, that's what I must forget that you people are seeing it how the game should be seen. You are not... not here to try and steal my secrets, are you? Steal your secrets? Not at all. Good. I was afraid I was going to have to abandon my lab here. That would mean starting all over again. It's not easy trying to make Ultra Jet, you know. Stop trying to talk your way out of this, zombie. What the hell is your problem? Save. Yes, we're gonna shoot him in the head and a save. Just, you know, I'm gonna see if he's got any good stuff on him. If he hasn't, then I'll uh, load back before I kill him. Hello. Yeah, it's not worth it. Load. Talk to him again. Oh, shit. 
Can we load? Is there an RSA before we came in here? Yes, thank you.